This is entropy. The whole thing is entropy. So I have one, actually it's n times the entropy because I have a block of length n. So this is 1 over n times n times h of x, which is equal to h of x. So I've established that expected value of l of x0 to n minus 1 is less than or equal to entropy, and it's greater than or equal to entropy. So therefore, this expected value of l of x0 to n minus 1 has to be equal to entropy. So, in other words, my simplified lentil ziv algorithm does, in the long run, achieve the entropy of the source. Any questions on that? So, once again, this provides the roadmap towards um, um, showing that the real lentil ziv algorithm is optimal. But um, in order to prove that, the, the analysis is significantly more complicated. But uh, that analysis is contained in the literature. And uh, the textbook has some good references uh, for you to go look up if you're so interested. So this concludes our discussion of source coding. So we are now finished with one of the major topics of the course. Uh, the next major topic, which we will start on Thursday, is channel coding. In channel coding, there are errors in the channel, and we're trying to protect the transmission against those errors. Um, so again, we're going to start basically from the beginning. We're going to talk about um, we're going to talk about um, um, transmission over noisy channels, and in that case, uh, what becomes important is the noise. Uh, so if you think back, way back to when we were first talking about uh, source coding, we're talking about typical sets. What becomes important in channel coding is joint typicality. So I send something, I receive something, and those things have to be jointly typical. And there's only so many ways that can occur. And because there are only so many ways that can occur, uh, we can construct a channel code that, uh, that does arbitrarily well, because there's only so many ways that um, a certain transmission can get corrupted into something at the other end. So we will start covering that in detail on Thursday. <coughs>